After revealing the second-generation Kia Nero late last year, now South Korean automaker Kia Motors has finally revealed new information about their all-new 2023 Kia Nero hybrid crossover SUV. Now we have more details about the new Kia Nero hybrid crossover. New 2023 Kia Nero will feature a newly updated powertrain, a new exterior that makes it more appealing than the previous model, and new interior with new updated features. And there are also new dimensional changes in the new upcoming model. In this video, we'll be talking about this all-new 2023 Kia Nero SUV so, stay tuned with us. First of all, talking about the dimensional changes and the new Kia Nero will be larger in size than the previous model. With increased width and slightly larger wheelbase. Length is also increased by 2.5 inches which should add seating space to the passengers and extra cargo room. Talking to the design highlights then we can say that its styling has been taken largely from the Kia Habanero concept car, which will offer interesting trim variants and more customization possibilities in the new upcoming model. New exterior changes feature a new design which includes new LED headlamps with new daytime running lights, a new front grille and an updated side profile with new alloy wheels. The rear profile is also updated with new body elements and attractive new tail lamps. Overall we see that the new exterior is much more appealing than the previous model which will help it to make its own different road presence. Talking to the powertrain changes then we see that the new Nero Hybrid will again use a powertrain that combines a 1.6-liter inline-four gasoline engine with an electric motor. New Kia Nero will have a six-speed dual-clutch automatic transmission option. Kia says the total output will be 139 horsepower, which is the same as before, and it will be front-wheel drive only. Kia says that this engine is optimized for more efficiency and lower weight. Speaking of maximizing efficiency, the new Nero comes with a green zone drive mode that automatically turns off the combustion engine when the navigation system detects a green zone. The driver can manually set green zones as well to force the crossover to work solely on electric power. A regenerative braking system is on board to feed energy back into the battery. Aside from having a totally different design, the second-gen model adopts a newly developed suspension and steering promising to deliver a more comfortable ride. Currently, details aren't yet available on the plug-in hybrid or electric versions, but they will surely use more powerful electric motors and larger battery packs. In the inside, the new Kia Nero comes with a 10.3-inch touchscreen infotainment system with Kia's connected car technology features and a digital gauge instrument cluster like many other new Kia models. A rotary shift knob, previously seen only on the Nero EV, is now standard on the hybrid models as well. New Nero will be having five-person seating layout and seating space in the interior is improvised. There's more room behind the rear seats mainly because the 12V battery is now positioned below them, together with the high-voltage battery. Talking to color options then there are nine main colors to choose from, plus six contrasting hues for the C-pillar, three for the cladding, and three fresh shades on the inside. Talking to the launch, then this new Kia Nero hybrid crossover is currently scheduled to be launched in Kia's home market that is South Korea and later year it will be launched in the global markets. In the meantime, we expect to see Kia provide more US-specific information in the coming months, we await specs for the other two powertrain versions to be offered, the plug-in hybrid and battery electric trims. What are your thoughts comment below and hit the subscribe button for more daily new automotive updates and thanks you for watching this video.